Hello, everybody. Welcome to Scotty Side. Thank you for joining me today. I really appreciate that. Uh, I got a little video here, a little YouTube short. Oh, my God. Let's just get into it. I think men have always gotten the princess treatments. <laughs> always. I think there has never been another time. The amount of standards men have for women oh, that's funny. is insane. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah. But the minute you have a woman okay. that says, like, hey, provide you know no. like, oh, no, take no, care no. of me it's like no you're a gold digger how, how dare you say that but how many men would date an unattractive woman uh, a lot actually uh, a lot you see already bitch you are so out of touch and i'm sorry to interrupt guys i know i interrupt videos all the time but i forget things if i don't say it okay bitch you you are going after that top five percent one percent whatever the fuck you're going after most average guys get with average women they get with below average women because that's all they can get so yes most men would date what you think is an unattractive woman to them you know we have different standards our standards are not as high as yours you you are so fucking privileged and a little fucking princess I can tell by the way you're dressed, the way you look, and the way you're talking, you are such an entitled little cunt. Oh my God. Exactly. They wouldn't. Oh, shut I mean, up, they fatty. They simply wouldn't. Okay? Yes, they would. Because they have that standard. If you're unattractive, nope. I don't want to nope. date you. But once a woman has a standard, and it's like, if you're a broke guy, and with broke guys, I don't mean men that are poor. Oh, right. no. I mean right. men that don't know how to create abundance. What does that even and mean? That, the, that's a big, big issue. I think men have always gotten the princess treatment. Okay, we're going to stop there too again. Yeah, we've always, yeah, we, we've always gotten the fucking princess treatment. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, yeah, we're not, we're, we don't go to war. No, we don't have, you know, the highest suicide rate. We don't have the highest workplace deaths. No, 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 no. Three out of four men aren't homeless. No, no, no. Yeah, we're the princesses. Sure, sure we are. Yeah, right. We're not the ones paying most of the child support alimony in this fucking country. Most of the taxes too. Yeah, yeah. We're not the ones working 80 hours a week, 60 hours a week to provide for you little cunts. Right, yeah, we're the fucking princesses. While you sit with your chubby little friend over there talking about how bad it is for you and you can't find these guys because they're just so entitled and they're princesses and blah, 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 diddy, blah. I don't even want to hear her talk anymore, but we'll, we'll let this go. Always, yeah. I think there's never been another time. No, bitch, there's never been another time where you are privileged up your ass. That's the problem. You don't realize how fucking many men go out of their way to give you such a privileged cush little life that you can sit there with your primped hair your face all done up your nails all done up because you live in the most highest society this world has ever fucking known the cleanest safest most wealthiest fucking country the world has ever known and you you have the gall to sit there and say that men are the fucking princesses where that building, those microphones, the electricity you're using, that stupid cell phone, that shitty fucking lip job that you have done would all not be possible without those men that you call princesses and because they have standards. Get the fuck out of my face, idiot. God, these kind of fucking women just piss me off. <laughs> oh, this is why I only do this shit once a week because I... this. Women like this are just fucking insufferable. Always. Yeah, we've always had the fucking princess treatment. Back in the day when we were tilling the farm and tilling the land and everything. Yeah, we were little princesses when we could afford one pair of clothing for years because we're that poor. Yeah, we were such princesses. Get the fuck out of here, dude. Jesus Christ. I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> I just don't like spoiled bitches like this. I just don't. I, I, and not even just women, but just people in general, spoiled like this. You, like, she is so fucking privileged. And she thinks that it's so tough for her. Please. Bitch, like Kevin Samuel said, buy a dog, die alone. I don't even care. Anyway, 
What do you guys think? Please let me know in the comments below. Did I miss anything there about her stupidity of her entitlement? I don't think so. I think I hit most of the points. But I'm sure someone will think of something. Let me know in the comments. Like, share, subscribe, all that stuff, please. I really appreciate it. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. I love you all. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.